Okay, it's kind of salty sweet though. <laughs> Oakley, Oakley, whoa! <laughs> hey you guys, welcome back to another video. This one's exciting. It is. We've been waiting for this video for how long? A long time. Like a month? I feel like we've talked about it before that. Before oh yeah. Even before we yeah. put out our first video. So this is like a little series that we're going to be doing. So basically, at the end of every month, we'll drop this type of video. But yeah, so we have two. We don't know what's in them. Uh, when I was picking my first box, I don't remember what I picked. I'm pretty sure I picked Germany, but then it was like, try one of these for your first boxes. Yeah. So I either said surprise me or I want it from Hawaii. I think mine was a surprise because I wanted one, but I don't think it let me pick. So I'm really hoping that my box is Germany because after we try these, I want to take some to my grandma to try because she has German in her. In her? Whoa. <laughs> <Sure>. <laughs> but anyways, we got it down here. Snap cream. So here it is. All right, so we're gonna let you guys see it first. So you guys can get a view. Oh. You uh, looked at it, didn't, no, didn't. you? Right, stuff's falling out, so hold on. Let me, uh, you did. No, I didn't, I really did. Let me, oh. You looked at it! I didn't know I was supposed to look at that, but I can't see, but. So we got the Hawaii one. So we tried to show you guys, but it's paper covering, so. Oh my gosh, it said, you guys, it's like in big writing. So it literally says these snacks are expired, and I was like, are you serious right now? And then I started to read it, and it's like, just kidding. All right, so. We will open it. This month's crate is from Hawaii. Capital is Honolulu. The population is only 1. like just under 1.5 million. Uh, fun facts, the Hawaii grows by nearly 42 acres each year. The result of Mount... Uh, Kilauea's. You know that for sure? Yeah. Okay. Ongoing eruption. <laughs> Snakes are outlawed in Hawaii, including all methods of transport. Surfing was invented in Hawaii. The Hawaii state fish is the... Humu 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 no, no, pow, pow. No. It's humu humu nuku nuku apu wa a. How do you know? Because High School Musical. Humu humu nuku nuku apu wa a. I never watched. There was that. a song. I've never watched that, but okay. AKA Reef Triggerfish. I'll call it that. The people of <laughs> <laughs> the people of Hawaii consume the most spam per capita in the U.S. So obviously, if you guys have seen other videos, I don't eat pork or beef or I guess just those two, but. I used to eat Spam when I was younger, and Spam was really good. Throw some ketchup and some rice with that. Ew. Wait, also, you guys, as a side note, if any of these are like, like say it's beef jerky, he'll try it. And I don't eat fish. But she'll try it. And I really hate to say this, but I will try it. But guaranteed I won't like it. Yeah, she has to try it. But yeah, let's get into it. All right, so take this sticker off. Oh, they came in clutch with the know Hawaiian if you chips. Guys can see from way back there, but that's what we got so far. That's just the top layer. Oakley wants some, looks like. So. Oh, these are gonna be fire. Looks like a lot of chips. Which is wait, what, what did you put for your salty and savory? Was your sweet and salty, savory and salty, something like that. sweet and salty. Yeah, I put a mix. All right, so we actually have a lot of stuff in here. Oh, there's a lot. A lot of stuff in here. So this is okay. This is exciting, actually. Some of these. We've tried before, or I've tried before. She's actually tried before too. But 99% of this stuff we have not. So Ooh. we'll just take everything out. All right, so what do you want to try first? Um, I say we try one of the chips first because there's so many of them. I want to try the jalapeno ones. All right, so jalapeno fired. These are fire, but I don't even like a blue onion. But you can't really taste the onion. So jalapeno. Hawaiian brand kettle style potato chip. Is that, yeah, we got that right there. That's what we're trying first. All right, here we go. Let's open this up. You, you always gotta some? do a little sniff test. Yeah, I mean, chips never really smell good. I don't think this. They smell good. You think it smells good? Yeah, it smells like Hawaiian chips. <laughs> um, yeah, they smell okay to me. But anyways, let's, uh, Let's try it. All right, ready? Mm -hmm. I mean, it's just a it's a jalapeno. That was this is be very good. simple. This is a jalapeno chip, this so obviously burnt. it's not like super crazy. I'll swap you. No. All right, here <laughs> we go. One, two, three. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I don't know if I said these are kettle style. 
So you got that real crunch to it? I feel like I need to eat more to actually taste the jalapeno. Or you just want more? That too. Not a product of Hawaii. <laughs> <laughs> I'm confused. It's good though. I mean, it's just, just a kettle chip jalapeno flavor. It's not that spicy. It's hard to taste the jalapeno. Good though. I'll finish that. No, I, I finished that one. This is um made in Hawaii. That's good. Um, it's a uh, piaka. Made in Hawaii. It's like a little cookie biscuit thing. All right. So, so we'll split this one obviously because there's only one. Cheers. Mmm. I just dropped it everywhere. <laughs> well, that's terrible. <laughs> I'm kind of like Faye Newton. It's actually not bad. What do you think? I don't know. I don't really like the breading. You don't? Mm -mm. I actually like this way more than I thought I was. Like I would eat these. Would I buy them? Probably not cause I'm, when it comes to like snacks or junk food or whatever. I don't typically go for- Sweets. Well, yeah, I, I'm, I'm more of like a chip kind of guy, but <laughs> I mean, this is, this is good though. If someone had this, I would take it. We forgot we can look and see exactly what these things are. So, I mean, the first one was pretty self-explanatory, but it says get a little island spice in your life with these jalapeno flavored crunchy potato chips. So the other one, which we don't have the package anymore, um, the, the is the Piaka Pineapple Shortbread. This authentically Hawaiian down. treat is made of all native ingredients and featuring sweet shortbread with the real pineapple filling. Yeah, I actually really like that. You thought it was okay? Yeah, it was okay. So the chips were what? The chips, I'd say seven out of 10. They were really good, but for some reason they didn't have like a strong jalapeno taste. I would say seven out of 10 as well. Um, but I'm not the biggest fan of kettle chips. Um, and yeah, the jalapeno flavor wasn't like strong or... Um, for the uh, shortbread with the pineapple filling, I think that was also a seven out of 10. I liked it, um, but again, it just comes to personal preference. It's not my go-to type of snack. I'd also give it a seven out of 10. I didn't like the cookie so much, and I feel like the pineapple wasn't very strong. You could have tasted it. I thought it was perfect for that. More? Really? I feel like I like I like strong taste though. So All I don't right. know. But we're gonna go to the next one. It's my turn to pick. I know, I'm just picking this up. I'm looking at what's inside. You look like an animal's in there. Ew. <laughs> All right, go ahead. I'm gonna go with these caramel corn Hawaiian style tropical pineapple and coconut. Uh, I don't like coconut. I don't know if you guys can see that. Island Princess Caramel Popcorn. So this is a chocolate one they show on here. We didn't get that one. We got a tropical one, but so sweet and crunchy caramel corn mixed with Decadent chocolate covered popcorn bites. So ours is exactly that minus the chocolate. We have pieces of pineapple. pieces of pineapple and coconut I wish we got the chocolate one not me. All right, so we have to get a piece of pineapple all in one Yeah, and I guess Should I put it back in. I don't like Coconut, but no, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'll do it for this. All right one two three You hate it? I can't chew the coconut Mm -mm. Nope. It's not horrible for me. I would prefer without the pineapple. I mean the uh, coconut. I'm also not a big fan of the caramel corn, really. I give mm -hmm. the coconut like a I don't know five out of ten. Because it's kind of hard to eat, but it's not strong. All right, so what do you rate this whole thing then? I'd probably give it a six out of ten. Six out of ten. It's not very flavorful, except for the caramel corn. So I would give this a five out of ten, which a five for me is I don't really care for it but it's not nasty. But again. I also feel like it's stickier than caramel corn. But it also looks a little different. Yeah, that was the worst one probably. It's not nasty. I mean, she gave it a six out of 10, I gave it a five. It's just not something I would uh, ever really want. I think we should go for this one. <laughs> Even though, I mean, most because we've already had it. Mm -hmm. So it's not really like a reaction or a first time try. But if you guys haven't had this, you should. If you're into like barbecue chips, um, this is sweet and spicy, crispy and crunchy, Hawaiian brand, kettle style. Same thing as the jalapeno ones, just a different flavor. You can buy, I don't know if you could buy the jalapeno ones anywhere, but I've seen uh, the barbecue ones at Safeway. Yeah, so we'll try it. Try it. We've already had it before. And I'm going to grab three at a time. He eats like because five I chips know it's at good. once. These chips too are the ones that get better the more you eat to me. Yeah, when you like eat one or like two, 
you, it doesn't have much flavor, but when you continue to eat yeah. them, it you can taste more it's, flavor. But also, not every chip has a lot of seasoning on it. It's one of those things where you can't just have a like a handful or whatever. Mm -hmm. You need to eat this whole bag. But yeah, that's all we're gonna do for this one because again, we've already tried it. I'd probably give that like a seven and a half or eight out of ten. That's definitely an eight out of ten. I really like those. I could still smash a whole bag, big bag. No matter the kind of chip, you guys. <laughs> He'll eat a whole bag of chips like a regular size in a day, in like 10 minutes. I'm grown. <laughs> All right, so we're, we're gonna move on to the next one. She's right. up. Mm, since you just did salty, I guess I'll do sweet. Ooh, these macadamia ones. My grandma loves macadamia nuts. Kona Crunch chocolate covered macadamia nuts with rice crisp. And on here it says, Hawaiian Sun Kona Crunch. Hawaiian macadamia nuts dipped in a mixture of rich milk chocolate with crispy rice added for a little extra snap in every bite. So, Kona Crunch. Pop these bad boys open. Oh. So it comes with two? Perfect. Yeah. Got these right here. I thought these would be like flat crisps. So I didn't know what to expect from this. But. It's kind of packaged like a peanut butter cup. Look at her. You guys, she's under the table. Oh, don't say peanut butter cup. <laughs> So if you guys watched our uh, previous video of our hike, he actually said he didn't like peanut butter cups. Disgusting, the worst candy ever. <laughs> so her saying that, that this reminds her of that. Just because of how like the wrapper. Me off, even though there's no peanut butter in here. All right, well let's try it though. I'm a, okay. Mm -hmm. It tastes like uh, another candy. What's the candy with the rice crisp in it? Crunch bar? Yeah, it uh, tastes exactly like a crunch bar. What do you think? I don't know. I feel like I give everything a 7 out of 10, but I think I'm going to go with 7 out of 10. Only because, like, it would be better if the, I feel like the chocolate had a weird taste to it. It just didn't taste like milk chocolate to me. I mean, it, it almost kind of tastes like dark chocolate. Yeah, I don't like dark chocolate, but it looks like milk chocolate. No, it's definitely milk chocolate, but I guess I kind of see what you're saying. I guess I would say 7 out of 10. If I was to get chocolate, this wasn't this wouldn't be my main choice. Not even my top three probably, but it's not bad. I would eat it again if somebody had it. All right, so the next one, I'm going to try. I said we go for one of these. They don't look the best, and... Uh, so, white rabbit candy, lightly sweet milk chews made with whole milk powder. The inner wrapper is made of edible rice paper. I was going to say it looked like rice candy. Mm -hmm. Not the outer one, but the inner one. I was going to say we eat this whole thing. <laughs> Alright guys, we are back. Sorry, our camera died. We, had um, a, we don't have a spare battery, yeah. so we had to wait way too long. <laughs> um, so the lighting might be a little different, the camera angle might be a little different, but we're still trying these. Alright, so we open this up. Oh, wait. My rice paper came off. My rice paper bent off. It's down on the table. I'm gonna eat it with it, though. It's like very little rice paper. All right, okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm just smelling it. All right, one, two, three. Oh. Ow. Let's put the whole thing in your mouth. Ew. Hmm. It's just old milk. Hmm. I did not like that. For one, it's really, really hard, and I don't want to like hurt my teeth. It's just super chewy, like, but like that hard chewy. And I don't like rice paper. It tastes weird, and bad. I give that a one out of ten, for sure. A one out of ten. A one? Yeah. I did not like that. But a one? I said what I said. <laughs> I'm barely swallowing it. I probably still shouldn't have, but. <laughs> It wasn't bad. I'll give that a 6 out of 10. Ew, a 6 out of 10? It wasn't bad. It's all on my teeth, though. So it's my turn? So for that, I put it down to a 5. <laughs> so my pick, because you picked the white rabbit, right? Mm -hmm. Is going to be these sweet dried mangoes. Um, sweet mango slice. Our favorite brightly colored tropical fruit dried and cut into yummy strips for easy snacking on the go. Ooh. I'm good. That does not smell good. It smells like chemicals. Oh, I, thought, I thought you were trying to say it smells good. No. It smells weird. Yeah, this smells like you're going to die instantly. You're going to take both pieces? No. You're going to take the smallest piece. I'm going to take the smallest piece. <laughs> good. The texture. <laughs> I thought you said it was good. Nah. Mm-mm. 
That was just the texture of dried mangoes. I don't like any of the dried fruit. <laughs> mm. I like my fruit fresh. It's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We're like the complete opposite. Heck no. Except with the other candy. Yeah, I can't do this. I'll probably give this like a 6 out of 10. I'll probably still eat the rest of them. Yeah, it wasn't bad. This for me is probably like a 2 out of 10. It's pretty gross. It's not like the nastiest thing I've had in my life. So actually like a 2.5. I say we try this. I've been eyeing this for a little bit. <laughs> you guys, he um, picked up one and he thought there was a bug in it. I don't know if you can see, there's like a little powder in there. I'm sorry if I'm saying this wrong, guys, but it's called Lai Hing Mui Drops. It's sweetheart candies flavored with plums with a pit of a real plum in the center. Can you eat the pit? I feel like pits are hard. You ready to stuff it in your mouth? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Like it. Tastes like caramel. Mmm. Mm. You like it. They taste like Werther's. If <laughs> you guys don't bit. know what Werther's are, we'll a put a bit. picture on the screen. I'm not gonna lie. But they taste like Werther's. It is kind of <laughs> salty sweet though. Oakley. Oakley, whoa! <laughs> Oakley, no. Oakley, you're killing me. So at first that didn't taste good, but... I liked it from the jump. When I first, when I started like eating it, and like sucking on it, it was like good. So I don't know, I just felt like a seven and a half out of 10. Yeah, I'll say seven and a half out of 10 for me too. Oh, those are pretty good. All right, we'll go with these ones. These Maui Caramax. Creamy, I feel like that's the same thing we just had. Creamy caramel and macadamias covered in milk chocolate. So this is Hawaiian Host Maui Caramax. Crunchy macadamia nuts are mixed with creamy caramel then dipped in rich milk chocolate. These are ridiculously good. All right. Ridiculously High good. High expectations. These look like us, these candies. Mm -mm. You can't have chocolate. It's very sticky. Yeah, the, the caramel is <laughs> crazy. It's good though. Better than the other one? The other chocolate? Yeah. Yeah, the chocolate tastes better. That Like just the chocolate part. Mm -hmm. I give this probably like a, let me try it again. It's very chewy. I think it's like an 8 out of 10. I was going to say a 9 out of 10. Mm. It could definitely use more macadamia nuts because you don't really taste them. Three left. Candy bead, high chew, and more chips. Um, this is just onion flavor. Maui onion. Which, I don't like onions, but I do like Wait, the sour other... cream and onion lays. Alright, I'm going to go with... We've had high chew before. Not this flavor, though. Did you say the flavor? This is acai. I feel like I've had all of them besides this one. I just tried them, but uh, I see we go with this. I'm really excited for this one. So Haichu, you guys have probably seen Haichu before. Anyways, Haichu acai. These juicy, these juicy fruit chews feature the unique acai berry flavor and real chia seeds, taking deliciousness to the next level. Will you cheers me? Ooh. The best smelling thing so far. They smell good at first, but now that I smell it, it smells like emergency. The. I don't know. I don't. Whatever. These are chewy. Very soft. These are very fresh. Mm-hmm. These are fire. What do you rate it? Eight out of ten. The chocolate was a nine? Mm-hmm. You said this was fire. I know. But um, after I said that, the flavor went downhill. Like it's still well. good, but you don't need to try another one. <laughs> you just like it that much. No. How fake. I'm gonna say eight out of ten too. It's not the best high chew I've had. They kind of start tasting like mango. I don't know about that, but... Or like a different flavor. Still good, though. Really Ooh. good. Down to two. Oakley. Okay, so between the two, the chips and the candy bead cookies, I'm going to have to pick... Which ones do you think I would pick? I don't know. Maybe this one? Because we've already had the chips. I was actually going to go with the chips. I'll take it, <laughs> Sure, I'll think of you not knowing what I'm going to pick. I thought you want to be... You want to explore and be different and... Ready? One, two, three. Ow. You like them? You don't like them. You're messing around. No, I do like them. But I like onion chips though. 
sour cream and onion chips, like the Lay's. I was gonna say, they're very oniony. Funyuns. I just don't like real onions. I like these a lot. These are better than the jalapeno ones. Mm -hmm. These are much better. And the jalapeno ones were good. Did you actually taste it? Like, first bite. Instant flavor. Mm hmm This is a 9 out of 10. Mm-hmm. It's one of the best ones that we've out of all this stuff here you guys when the camera died we were i was looking through this pamphlet and i seen it's called teriyaki tuna jerky and i'm so glad we didn't get that we didn't get no seafood anything it's wild caught hawaiian tuna and marinated in teriyaki seasoning i mean teriyaki seasoning <laughs> anyway last but not least we got hawaiian cookies candy bead made in hawaii diamond bakery this is the last one. Diamond Bakery Candy Bead. Dotted with colorful sprinkles and flavored with a hint of lemon. These cookies are her Hawaiian favorite. Oh, <laughs> All right, let's crack these open. Here we go. Last but not least, one for you. What about Oakley? And one for me. Oakley don't get none. One, good. two, one, two, three. <laughs> What are you doing? Oh my god. Show it. I can't. You just need something to drink with it. Like it's very dry. Mm-mm. You need milk. This right here would probably be good if we just make it into some cereal. Throw this in a bowl, you know what I'm saying? Put some milk in there. Get your spoon. You can't eat this by itself. There's they no remind way. me. First off, they're not good. But the crunch with the candy in it, they remind me of the animal cookies. You know the Frosted animal cookies? Everyone, ones? Yeah, but everyone used to like those. I liked them, I just don't. I would never buy them. Yeah, this for me is a six out of 10. Um, you have to be lower than that. <laughs> what is it? Two out of 10. All right, two out of 10 for her, six out of 10 for me. All right, I mean, well, what did you think of all the stuff though? What did you think of Hawaii's, uh, Hawaii's stuff? I mean, it tasted like normal to me because a lot of that we have like here where we live in California. So it wasn't like anything exotic besides like, it wasn't, nothing was exotic. It was just, some things were different than what we're used to. Yeah. But even but, like this candy, like with the pine nut in the middle or what was in that? I mean, that's the most different thing probably. It tasted even though, like something we already had. Yeah, but I never had anything with like a seed inside. Or like yeah, a, no, not with the seed inside. Whatever that is. Side. But of all these, you like most of them? Mm -hmm. I would say Hawaii was a good one. Um, the chips were all fire. But you're a chip guy. But the chips were great though. Yeah. If anybody, I feel like if you got this, if you got this exact box, you guys would like the chips. The chocolates were cool. One of them was really good. The other one was still good. Uh, the high chew was good. It's not even fun. But yeah, so that's gonna be it for this video. Hawaii was the theme. Like I said, we're gonna be doing these videos once a month. We already got another one. You get down from there. But we'll be saving this for next month's video. Comment down below what country you guys think it, it's from. Yeah, we actually don't know. But, um, I think I got the mystery one. This one's actually bigger too than her box. Yeah. I don't know why, because I thought we got the same um, size. So I don't know if there's more stuff in here or not, but. Unless this country has like bigger, like poofier bags. Yeah, unless the items are just bigger, but. Anyways, you guys and us will find out what this is next month. So if you enjoyed this video, definitely give it a big thumbs up. That helps us out a lot. Um, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Um, share this video if you think anybody would be interested in watching it. We thank you for tuning in. Um, if you guys want to try a snack crate, um, if it's your very first box, you'll get 50% off. And if you use our code, no, it's fine. We don't got it. Yeah, we don't have a code, <laughs> but you guys should try it though. I, th I think it's cool to try new stuff from different places. Mm -hmm. um, even though this one wasn't too different, like she said, we've seen some of these things. Anyways, that's me for the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Catch you guys next time. Mm -hmm.